the biggest thing that I see missing from a lot of young composers is the education. I think they need to spend more time on the literature and the, the training and the technique. I think it would help them immensely. Even if they think they're just a MIDI composer and they're just a, you know, an electronic composer, they should still know how it works. I remember going into a, a dance studio once where a guy was mixing a dance record. And uh, Robert Irving was with me. We looked at the guy and said, do you know what that chord is? And he said, no. He was making a whole long dance record. He had no idea what key was in or anything, you know. <laughs> you should know where it comes from. You got to understand how it works. It's not that crazy. It's, it's a beautiful thing, actually, if you know how harmonies work and why an inversion works. And, you know, I remember turning to a composer and saying, why don't you use more common tones in your modulations? He had no clue what I was talking about. And I felt badly for him because I said, you know, it's such a simple device that you could use. It's so effective. But um, I think the training is important. Now, if you have talent and if you're really good at what you do, that craft will give you additional strength to do what you're doing, you know. And most of the composers that have risen to greatness have a background. They have a background. And it's important. 